Hey everyone, welcome to the T4 Show. My name is Michael Manna, and today I'm going to show you how to put together a movie trailer using iMovie 11. And I, I really think this is one of the, the, the most fun updates that they provided in the iLife series. And uh, iMovie is definitely one of my favorite applications to use and the addition of movie trailers, as you can see by the movie trailer that I put together in under five minutes up on T4 Show videos here on YouTube. Very easy to use, very easy to put together. So I already got a few clips put together uh, for a project using Sugar Mask and the Shark here, but I'm going to show you what I did beforehand. Now, if you open up the plus sign here, I'm going to go back, plus sign, you get your project themes, but you also get the new edition of movie trailers, and you can pick pretty much anything you want. And uh, I used Epic Drama for that test trailer that I did. And as you can see, it's different than what I had with the pyramid. You can change the beginning to anything that you want. I'm going to show you that in a minute. But yeah, you can see the text is different. You can change the text. You can change anything, but it provides a good template. Uh, as you can see, cast members one, so it can show one person. There's also other ones that have two, like this one. And then there's ones that have two to six. So uh, you basically have an idea of how many people that you can put into the trailer. But it's really just a suggestion in there using the uh, People Finder, I think. So I already have this project set up using the sports uh, trailer theme. As you can see, I have an outline. So I have a movie name right here. So I'm going to call this, since sort of Sugar Mask said it, I chose me okay so you can put any date that you want for it to to be out so i'm gonna put summer 2011. there you go down in content productions now i can pick whatever i want i can pick the glowing pyramid i can pick just a black background spinning earth in space i mean you get the picture or whatever i can do i will go and then i don't like that old school one i'm gonna go with the glowing pyramid there also you see the credits here directed by uh edited by written by executive producer director of photography all the other stuff you can put it in there it's kind of cool and that's cool there so you have a storyboard here which you can pick and as you can see it tells you exactly how long the clips have to be i, I really think that's a nice little uh touch to, to show you and also suggest what you can uh, put in there with different stuff. Now the shot list makes it even easier because now you have action clips, group clips, uh, close up, medium, wide, all that stuff. And this, these are all sort of suggestions uh, for what to make it flow right. So as you can see here, I have some clips and I needed a clip that's an eighth of a second long. So I'm already highlighted the clip and I have Sugar Mask here doing this. So I'm going to have Sugar Mask choking the shark out. And it's got to be eighth of a second. So I don't want that. That's not good. See, it automatically drops it in there when you make it there. So I want this one right here. I'm going to make it an eighth of a second long here. And then it drops in there. So it's basically... Now I need a seventh of a second one. I'll get this one and make that a seventh of a second Whoops, that's not what I wanted. It's a little touchy there with using the trackpad, but there, eight, eight seconds, close enough. You can see how I can throw these together pretty easily into something there. So I'll make that a six of a second. I mean, you get the idea of how it can be uh, utilized. Then you have the medium shot there. So I can basically, now this is a part that I don't understand. Even though it mutes out the clip of the, uh, say I take this clip here, which is 2. Second, 2 2.1 seconds long, around that. Now you see it's moody, muted out there, but it's going to come up with sound in the trailer. I don't understand why it did that, but it seemed to do that, you know, no idea why. So let's see here. We got another action shot here. I'm going to. Have Sugar Mask press slamming the shark. It's got to be a couple seconds long here, so 2.5. That goes right in there. Then we have a couple more action shots up here. We will have him throwing the shark. You can see how easy it is to just plug stuff in there, just like that. And then I need a wide shot of Sugar Mask, so I'm going to try to get that 
wherever I can. I can do it here again. I mean, you get the idea. So I'm just going to throw these together. And you see it chose me, summer 2011. So I'll give you a sample of what it looks like right here from the very beginning. I didn't have all the clips, but you get the idea. <laughs> uh, I chose me. Summer 2011. But there you go. I mean, it's a pretty cool way to put together a trailer. If I took a few extra minutes to really put it together, it would definitely be filled in and it'd be a full trailer so that's how you do it very easy play around with it play with all the different uh, trailer themes and have a good time with iMovie 11 but for now for everybody here at C4 show thank you and best of luck in all your future trailer endeavors